Greetings in peace. I hope you and yours are doing well today, wherever you might be watching this from. Now the title of this video is Why You Should Always Keep Your Cool. Growing up in this country, in the U.S., from an Eastern perspective, and having the privilege of growing up in two different cultures, I realized the aspect of dealing with the human element, people's relations, getting to know people, and realizing at the end everyone kind of is aiming for the same things same goals and achievements for themselves, for their families, the people that they love, etc. And one thing I noticed is majority of the time where anything had went wrong, it was when somebody had failed to keep their cool. Where a few seconds of anger or indecision or anxiety, anything like that could cost you in a very large way. Because something costing you is not just in a financial way. It could cost you your health, your sanity, your peace of mind, etc. So in this life, when you're on a certain spiritual level, you do experience spiritual warfare. It just comes with the territory. It's not restricted to America alone. I've seen it in all countries, races, religions, and groups, that internal struggle between light and dark. And why, if you know who you are, what you stand for, what your purpose is, and knowing in your heart with a firm conviction that good is destined to win, you won't let anybody get under your skin. If they post anything or if they, somebody says something when they walk past you or something that's meant to trigger you, keep your cool. Because in America, everything is one big mind game. If you don't give anybody any reaction, then they don't have nothing on you. You maintain your cool. You know how everything works. You maintain yourself in a legal, lawful, respectful, and civil way. There's nobody here that can touch you. And at the same time, you keep doing what you're doing in terms of your spiritual purpose that you're meant to serve. But at the same time, as long as you keep your cool and don't give anybody any reason to say nothing, then you're always way ahead of the game, knowing your conviction, who you are, what you're meant to do. Always keep your cool, no matter what. And I know in the many aspects of the spiritual warfare community, you always have individuals, people from your past, present, future that could be used against you in some way, shape, or form as mates, friends, lovers, etc. But you must always keep your cool. Know when to take what decision at what time and always keep your cool. Because when somebody gets you angry, then they got you. Because that, that means then whatever is being hashed against you can be used against you. And you kind of put yourself in your own hole. But if you maintain your cool, I've seen it time and time again, and I'm telling you from personal experience, those that dig holes for you fall into their own holes. It's just the way the laws of the universe and karma and the laws of Almighty God work in a very beautiful and vivid manner, like an artist painting his picture on the canvas. So whether you're in school, college, workplace, wherever your life's vocations and situations and events take you, if you know who you are, you always keep smiling, you maintain your cool, and don't let anything be used against you, you're going to be all right. You are going to be absolutely fine. And that's the beauty of this entire journey called life. No matter where God places you on this earth, no matter what vocation you get placed in, always keep your cool and everything goes accordingly. And always keeping your cool is the key to having peace. Take care and much love to all of you.